What's up? I'm Carl Wagner, catcher, class of 2023. Play for US Elite Mid Atlantic. Um, I'm uncommitted, and this is what's in my baseball bag. So, starting out with the bats right here. Uh, this is an anchor 34 inch, uh, 32 ounce wood bat. Um, a high school coach of mine actually hooked me up with this. Uh, he came to practice one day and was like, here, I got a free bat from one of my buddies that works for MLB and just gives them demo bats, I guess. Um, and I, I just, I've loved it and he just let me keep it. So that's a wood bat that I just keep in my bag. My gamer is a 33 inch, 30 ounce bomb bat. Um, and I put on some lizard skin and I wrap the handle too because I just, I just love the way that feels. Um, and I've been using this for since last July, a ton of pop. Love the brand, love the feel, and hasn't hasn't broken yet. Um, and my metal bat that I use is a 2022 Warstick Gunner. I don't have it with me because we're at a wood bat tournament. Um, but those are the bats that I game. Uh, so starting off with my bag, I have I have my turfs. They're uh, Mike Trout's model, the 2022, um, in size 12. I love them. They're comfy. I can wear them like in game, just if I'm training at a facility or even if I'm just walking around sometimes. I'll wear them too. Um, and then my cleats. I have the Harpers in all white and gold um, with the molds in the back and the spikes in the front. I've, I've loved these. They're really light and um, I get great traction with them and they're really comfy for me when I catch. Um, just because I don't want something too heavy, but I also want something that's kind of like durable. Um, next, I have my batting helmet. It's a Rawlings uh, helmet that US Elite gave us a while back when we first start. Um, nothing too special. I put on a C-flap. I've tarred it up. It's all dried out now, but I've had this thing for years, and I've had no complaints with it. Um, okay. Next, here's my fielding glove. Uh, I've, I've had this baby since seventh grade, so uh, she's she's pretty old and pretty beat up. But um, I've I've used it for years and I've had I've had no problems with it. It's a Pro 315, 11 and three quarters. Um, I played shortstop with it this this year in high school, and I've played third base with it in high school as well. So this is this has been through a lot. Um, next, I have this is my old catcher's glove as well. Um, I've had this thing since. Seventh grade, I believe. It's a Rawlings Heart of the Hide mitt, um, and it's a 33 inch. And I really, I, I relaced it a few years ago with red laces um, and tied a wristband on it that broke off during a game one time. I played hundreds of games in this. I bet caught hundreds of baseballs, and uh, it's it's just been a workhorse for me. So I'm definitely a Rawlings guy. But recently, a uh, kid on my team who loves to collect gloves, Caden Hall, uh, he he just got a mitt just to say that he could have a mitt because he likes to collect gloves and uh, so he gave me this all-star pro elite mitt um, and I've absolutely loved it it's a smaller pocket it's lighter than Rawlings but it's just so controllable for me to actually move pitches back into the zone and things like that um, and it came with this with this wrist guard too which is nice for blocking in case I ever get hit right there it doesn't sting me up at all um, so from here on out I might be an all-star glove guy but uh, I guess we'll have to see and then my catcher's gear, um, I'm also an all-star guy. I've been using all-star gear for a while. Um, so here's the shins, I've had these for a while. They're, they're kind of beat up, they're, they're still dirty from the last game. Um, but most comfortable shins I've ever had, I've been able to wear shorts with them and catch, which is actually huge for a catcher because normally it's really un uncomfortable for these straps to be around your legs. Um, but no complaints there. Chest, all-star, pretty standard. Uh, it's got the big no case standard thing. Um, and I keep this on as well. And I, I, I personally like to keep it pretty tight on me just so that it's not moving around when I'm catching or blocking or receiving or anything like that. Um, and then my helmet, uh, it's still part of the set. Same Rollings helmet, uh, System 7 gear. And then on the side, I have tape that says Raw, which is my grandfather's initials, so it's just a reminder every time I go out there who I'm playing for and someone that helped me a lot along the way. Um, and yeah, and then 
inside my bag on the sides I have these Gatorade Zero pouches so in case um, I'm ever really dehydrated during the game and I just want something that's not water I'll mix this in with like my shaker bottle over there or something like that um, I have ibuprofen in here in case I ever, any, anything's ever hurting which uh, is kind of often these days I have a pro hitter uh, just throw that on your thumb and uh, just just gets rid of the vibration, especially for these wood bats in case you get rung up pretty bad. Um, here's my 100% sunglasses case, um, and these these are the shades right here. I've loved these; um, they've been great. You, you get a huge line of view when you put them on. It's great color, um, and they're so lightweight you just forget that you're wearing them. They they never really fog up. Super easy to clean. Nice durable case. I love them. Um, <laughs> next, I have cologne. So when you're on the road and your gear starts to smell up a little bit, uh, you know, you don't have time to wash it. So I just spritz this on. Umpires love it. Um, keeps, keeps me smelling, smelling clean. And then these are the game batting gloves right now. They're Franklin's large. I've always liked this silver look just because it's, it's not too flashy and it's kind of modest and it just, it just looks clean. Uh, they're starting to rip a little bit, but um, I'm going to use these things until they're all gone. So that's the first pair of batting gloves. I have another pair of Franklins in here. Uh, these are size mediums. I actually let my buddy borrow them during the season. Uh, so they're like nice and broken in. So these are like the backups. And these are the backups of the backups. These are war stick batting gloves, kind of like a knockoff of the uh, Bruce Bolts. So they wrap all the way around. They're, they're fully leather, which is kind of annoying just because it's super, it's a super thick glove. You don't get much grip on them. But, um, I mean, they, they match the colors really well. I'm just not a huge fan of them. Um, and then I have just a ton of baseballs in here. Just good, like, game balls in case, like, we ever got to warm up with the pitcher and I just need someone to warm up with a good game ball. Um, then I have tape. Um, I would tape up all the time in high school. Me and, me and my buddy would on the, on the left side of the infield. We would always tape up. Shout out Liam Sayer. Um, and that is everything in my baseball bag. Hey guys, since we hit 10,000 subscribers on the channel, YouTube let me open up a merch store right on my channel. All you have to do is go to my channel, click the store tab, then click an item and it will take you right to the merch store. Every item sold is helping grow the channel and bring you guys more videos. So check it out, be sure to subscribe, and don't forget to like this video. And once again guys, thank you so much for supporting the channel and getting it to 10,000 subscribers.